folks, Coach Sean here. Today I want to talk to you about the role of a strength coach. What is the role of a strength coach? Or you, this can apply to uh, you know, personal trainers or instructors or what have you. My role, my personal role as, my, as a strength coach, okay, is this, the following. I can provide guidance in according to what your goals are. I can provide guidance of what I feel is the best strategy to attain those goals, those physical goals, those mental goals, and those life goals, what have you. I can provide guidance through my experience, my expertise, and what has worked in the past. I can provide guidance that way. Okay? Second, I can supervise. I can supervise and make sure that the sessions or our training programs are as safe and efficient as possible. No injuries or minimum risk of injuries, maximum strength potential, and maximum safety. Okay? So I can supervise. Third, I can coach. This is where the expertise comes in. I can provide those subtle tips and hints on how to amplify our efforts and really maximize our, our efforts and our benefits for uh, through, uh, through training. Okay? Really get those results. And the last one, I say I can inspire. And I can inspire by leading by example, all right? by encouraging, by trying to make the sessions as light as possible, but in no way, shape, or form can I motivate. Motivation will be the death of us all. <laughs> Motivation has to come from within. It has to be the individual's why, why they're doing it. So I can inspire, but I can't motivate. Motivation has to come from within, and there has to be self-discipline. And that, my friends, cannot be taught unfortunately. Okay? That's the role of a strength coach, at least through, through me okay? at, at the Barry Kettlewell Club and through Charlotte Strength and Conditioning. That is our role and it, it's not to motivate and handhold. Okay? Take care.